Now, Lily, the stripes there actually make it a little bit more difficult for the predators to see the animal. They live in an area where the bush is thick and where the light doesn't fall how do I say this? The light is dappled, so it is broken up by the trees and branches above it. And in such light, being striped helps to hide you from your predators. So if they go very still, they're quite difficult to see. And what's interesting also is that when a predator looks at an animal like that, it's actually not seeing the same colors that you and I are. We look at it and we think, oh, that's a very rich kind of chestnutty red-brown color. It's quite easy for us to see. But the predators out here, the cats and the dogs, are largely what we call red colorblind, or blue-green colorblind, sorry. So they don't see red. They don't see the color red. And that means that that animal blends quite nicely into its background compared with an animal like us that sees in full color. So we see in three kinds of colors, blue, green, and red, and mixtures of those colors. And most of the, or many birds do as well. Uh, so do monkeys and baboons, we think, but most of the predators out here only see blue and green, and that's why that rich red colour is actually quite a good colour.